Wow, you will love this video and I got so many emails to make a video review on a Greg Anabolic cookbook too. So you all know, or if you don't know, I made uh, the video review of Greg Anabolic cookbook 1. So I decided to do a review on a cookbook 2. You can see, this is the first one. That's all the meal we cooked. That's his first one. And uh, that's Greg, the second cookbook. So you can see I print it all out. Yeah. Okay, let's start. There are a few reasons why I bought the second cookbook and I did my first review of Anabolic Cookbook when I just started my channel. So I, at that time I think I had about 26 subscribers and I'm about to hit 1000 subscribers. Thank you very much and healthy happy new year. The first reason is that I like his recipes. It's straightforward. The second reason is that my son loves to cook meals from Greg cookbook. Not all, but majority. I wouldn't expect him to like every single meal. He can read and follow the recipe and I will help him when it comes to the oven or blender or something like that. It's straightforward to follow and my seven years old son understand 90% of what he have to do. My daughter is eight and she likes some recipes too and she can cook them independently while I'm in the kitchen. My little one always wants to help and he thinks if he eat like Greg, he will look like Greg. Who knows? <laughs> The third reason why I bought Greg an Abolic cookbook because I wanted to thank him for posting amazing videos and inspiring many people to eat right and know the truth about diet and training. He's not a dietitian nor nutritionist, but he knows more than majority of certified dietitians and nutritionists. They make it so complicated. They use these words that, uh, I don't know, make them clever, so I don't know. But when you talk to dietitian or nutritionist, sometimes they want to look cool, I guess, and use these kind of words that, I don't know, <laughs> majority of people wouldn't understand. So, thank you, Greg, for awesome videos. And I was impressed of the Anabolic Cookbook too. And I mean, I was really impressed. If you are new to my channel, please like and subscribe and don't forget to press the red bell button to receive notification every time I post new video. I try to post three videos per week, but with the lockdown and homeschooling three kids, it's a bit hard, but I try. I try the harder than the last time, <laughs> than the first lockdown. So, let's go through the cookbook. There are prawns and, of course, cons. I hope you will like this video. I just want to let you know that no one paid me to review his cookbook. No one gave me a massive discount uh, to uh, review his cookbook. Yes, I got the discount. So, uh, the cookbook is £145 and I bought uh, Greg Anabolic cookbook 2 for £99 so he sent the um, discount code for everyone who purchased his first cookbook so um, that's when uh, I bought and uh, this review is my honest review and I hope you will like it the cons would be the price but Yes, it's not cheap and there are lots of cookbooks you can buy much less than £145 and I mean much less. 
but that didn't stop me because I watch Greg videos and he's not BS people I don't watch every single video I watch only what I like and some of the videos we watch together with kids my boys like his muscles <laughs> They always come and say, look, 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 he've got that muscle coming out. Look, 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 he've got that muscle coming out. So they always look out for muscle. Greg, my boys request. Greg, can you show me all your trophies? How did you get bodybuilding? How did you get these big muscles? Greg, Maddox is going to be seven in the end of these months and he really asked me to ask you to show the trophies. If you can, please do, you make his day. Okay, the second reason why I bought the book. When I bought the book, I print all out and put in uh, folders like you can see. So, there is all the folders. Yep, you, you can see. The reason why I printed out because I wanted to look like a proper book, like all my other books. So I like books. And it's easy for me and kids, so they can choose what they want to cook and that particular day. Let's say if they ask me to cook apple cinnamon muffins so they look the ingredients they ask me for certain ingredients uh, i lay them out and they kind of they can do it themselves so it's straight forward it's really that easy and as you can see it's all in a book form i just like books pen and paper that's my thing i even do all my clients uh, diet plan uh, on uh, paper and then transfer to the computer. I guess I'm an old school, <laughs> I don't know, but I prefer it like this. Then I lay out all the uh, like blood test and uh, what I want for that particular diet and it's just easier for me. And then ready plan I transfer to a computer. You can see I've got the new Aurora, my new PC. It's a monster, I'm going to make a video about that too. When I started printing, I couldn't believe it, how many pages. My printer was going on and on and on. I thought it will never stop. <laughs> there will be a never the end of it. Maddox was standing next to a printer and keep saying, Mommy, he have a pictures there too. We can see it, what we are going to cook. Yes, there are pictures of some meals Thank you, Greg. But why of some meals? Why not all? Uh, yeah, it would, it would be nice. It would be nice. It would be great. People like picture. But again, it doesn't matter. It's not much matter. There is just some pictures and quite you know, a few pictures. Uh, but the general, the meals are easy and simple. So thank you, Greg. I especially like pictures there on the top. Let's say they've got the picture there and the ingredients and the instructions below. It's fantastic. There is on the page, I think is 94. I'm sure it is, yeah. I think it's a 94. Yes, like on a page 94, so there is a picture there and then direction ingredients at the bottom and you can purchase certain ingredients online if you use ebooks or you click and buy. It looks very cool and you tend to want to start cooking these meals first, but there are not many of like these pictures, sadly. But never mind. Greg, try harder than the last time. I know you tried, you did really hard. And wow, you worked very hard on this cookbook. You can see some pictures, just a one page, very colorful, uh, beautiful, fantastic. The layout, it's very simple and really straightforward. There is not much writing, like if you pick up any cookbook, there will be like pages, pages, and using the words that you think, okay, what's that mean, what's that mean? So it's very 
easy to read and it's very easy to follow. When you open this book, the first page is a table contents, like varieties of French toast, uh, appetizers, muffins, tacos, wraps, ice cream, protein bars and so on. So you can see what you fancy, go to that page and just simply start cooking. He also have references of fruits and vegetables like on his first cookbook so you can see how many calories per 100 grams don't need to look on my fitness pal how many grams per such and such food and calories so you don't need all that so you already know it's it's there in front of you easy it's a quite a big list so you can choose a low calorie fruits and vegetables and if you want you can eat just that so you have options it's good to have options I also like the way the book written but I'm not sure of some photos where Greg with a shouting pose I think he have a much better pictures come on Greg you do have much better pictures they are in the end of the book a picture of you with a little bit fake smile <laughs> your smile natural is much better than that the one the fake one I don't know where is it I don't know if you can see no yeah. here we go there is your picture so in real life it's much better but that's I presume that doesn't bother many people it's just maybe me <laughs> I guess it's probably only me. I also noted that he gives an equivalent choice to some sweeteners. So if you don't like Splendor, for example, and it says one packet, you can replace with eight gram of erythritol. I think it's a very useful for some people. I don't know for who, but it's very useful. I personally use Sugarly, and I think it's the best sweetness out there it looks like sugar it tastes like sugar and it's the best out there in the market you can see a link in the description below so it's really good sweetness <laughs> trust me it's very good third if you follow vegetarian vegan diet there are recipes for you too more vegetarian than vegan but it shouldn't be a problem. Nowadays you can buy alternative to egg whites, dairy, meat. There is lots of varieties in the shop. I was amazed when a couple days ago I went to the shop. I usually order everything online, uh, food delivery online. So I went to the shop and when I saw the aisle of vegan food, I was like, wow i didn't see this before it was wow so if it says i don't know beef uh i don't know where is it let's say wraps with beef then you can use vegan beef so there won't it wouldn't be a problem for you you will find the alternative use your imagination you can come on you can if it says chicken buy vegan chicken slices if you have celiac disease then buy alternative foods that's suitable for your diet that's simple so you can make it simple plus now there is more variety of vegan food than it was like i don't know a year ago or two years ago the anabolic cookbook too will suit most people because you don't have to buy rice protein that some people find it difficult to purchase that could be a price or they not deliver to certain countries for me it was the price I thought it was a little bit expensive uh, 72 pounds for two tubs plus delivery and tax it was it was just a lot and I thought no I'm not gonna buy it again and I bought it first time and I didn't buy it the second time because it's just too much for this amount of money you can buy protein powder in the UK for much less so 
And that's why I stopped buying the rice protein. In this cookbook, you can buy ingredients in uh, most stores. They are simple and easy accessible. You probably have uh, more than half of this. So if you're watching Greg videos, uh, you probably already have them. And majority of people have some of the ingredients in the cupboard that they never used. So they will be using them for uh, this cookbook. There are some that you cannot buy in London, but you can find alternative very similar. I couldn't find carb balanced tortillas. I found it very expensive to buy Icon protein bread uh, from another country. The cheapest was $28 for four little loaves, plus delivery, plus you have to pay tax in the post office. So, um, no, <laughs> no, thank you. There is a link in the description below which bread wraps I use. They are very similar to what Greg used and some, let's say, flat out bread uh, he used in his first cookbook. So, um, some low carb wraps and bread I buy from Amazon or I think it's low carb mega store. So, there is a link in the description below. I also found that in some recipes he have a link so you can click and purchase. So if you haven't got, let's say, what's, what's this bit? Meatless veggie bologna slices. So there is a link, click and buy. So easy. Each time you buy, you might get a discount uh, if you click on these links. Uh, I don't know, uh, or maybe Greg get uh, like small commission from each person. Uh, but I mean small, affiliate links, they don't give you much. Oh, it's Russia calling me now. <laughs> I need to put it on silent. Because I already break the video a few times because my phone was ringing and ringing and ringing. So, uh, where did I stop? Oh yeah, so each time you buy from the link he suggests, he might get a little commission uh, and you might get a discount, so try it. In the both cookbooks, Greg used a lot of Walden Farm syrup, but I use fiber syrup. As I don't like this fake taste from Walden Farm or skinny syrup, some good, but majority don't. I still have this kind of aftertaste, I don't like it. So he used fiber syrup too on some meals like desserts, baking, which is very, very good. Fiber syrup is prebiotic fiber like inulin powder and it's fantastic for your gut. There is a link in the description below which fiber syrup I use and uh, which uh, inulin powder I use and suggest to a lot of my clients. Again, fiber syrup, it's very difficult to get uh, in London or you pay uh, like 12 pounds for small bottle and it doesn't last you that long. Tiny bottle, I wish I could buy a liter, but I couldn't find it. I just couldn't find it where I can buy a liter or two of fiber syrup because I use it quite often. When kids found cheesecake, I was very, very, very happy as it is my weakness and I like good cheesecake. Protein cheesecake looks awesome. It looks fantastic and it tastes even better than it looks. Wow, that's spot on great. But when we start cooking and I read the ingredients, uh, so it was 400 gram of cauliflower and I thought really is it misspell or is it just are we doing the cook are we doing the cheesecake or what so anyway I followed the recipe I wasn't sure but I followed it and when it's all done and I thought wow <laughs> I thought I couldn't believe it that it have a cauliflower in them and that's great so you he put the vegetables in 
to cheesecake. It does taste good. It sounds a bit not right, but it tastes good. <laughs> With each spoon, I, I forgot about the cauliflower. The most important for me, I can tell you for sure, it's delicious and I love it so much. You wouldn't taste cauliflower, trust me, you wouldn't. It just tastes good. My kids' favorite are vanilla chocolate chip pancakes, blueberry banana protein loaf, apple cinnamon muffins, and actually, actually they love it all. <laughs> yeah, it's just the, the few I could memorize the one that they add a lot. But in general, all the desserts are the best. I also like that you can use any protein powder, so you don't have to buy rice protein powder like in his first book. I use these protein powders and they work great for me and I love them, they come up really good. Yes, rice protein powder really good, but again, uh, I just I need to finish that rice protein powder anyway for that price. But I use, let's say, yeah, this. These protein powders are used for both cookbooks. Hmm? Greg use fat-free cheese and I use eat lean cheese. If you are in the UK, you can buy directly from them, uh, the link in the description, or from Waitress. Tesco. Have a look in Waitrose or Tesco. I d I'm not sure if they deliver uh, abroad. I know they deliver in the UK. It's really good cheese. Uh, all eat lean cheese products are high in protein and taste brilliant. I like eat lean cheese product. It's high in protein, low in fat, um, so great. It works for everyone. I also like that with each meal he have prep time and uh, it says whether it's vegetarian, gluten free or whether it's vegan uh, or is it difficult or easy to cook, it says this one it says easy to cook, it's delicious quesadilla, quesadilla, yeah something like this. So there is uh, other meals let's say double open face hot chicken burger, uh, difficulty medium, fantastic, veggie pigs in a blanket, hot dog, vegetarian, meatball sandwich on a protein bread, vegan, best, it's really good, I have tried a vegan meatball sandwich on a protein bread but instead of protein bread I use flat out wrap and these meal was delicious. Kids didn't like it because vegan meatballs was a bit bit too spicy so maybe that's why they didn't like it much. I'm not a vegan by the way, I eat everything. I like everything, I don't have particular food I don't like, I just eat everything. I also noticed that you have pasta variation uh, like uh, chicken and beef and he used pedon pasta. I cannot find in the UK, but I found alternative in Sainsbury and Waitrose. And I also order some online on regular basis like wraps, bread, uh, low carb pasta, grains for example. Things what I order online on regular basis, there is a link in the description below. If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to press like, subscribe and press the little red bell button so you receive notification each time I release new video. I try to release three videos per week, but with the lockdown, schooling and work, it's just a little bit difficult, but I try. I try harder than the last time. Wow, you have to try chocolate cookie explosion and chocolate chip brownie cookie. My daughter said it is the best thing in the whole world. No, she said it's the best thing in the whole wild world, something like this. Basically, it's the best thing, so she likes it and it is really good, it's, it's really nice. <laughs> wow, I laughed about apple goop or poop. 
<laughs> and kids too when they saw this dessert apple poop my son said why greg want people to eat poop with a serious kind of expression <laughs> so i guess he changed to apple poop maybe because of the youtubers who everyone was trying to uh, cook apple goop yeah and one of them called apple poop i think that's why but it did make me laugh so it's i think it will be very uh, memorizable if there is such word so thinking of apple goop i did explain to my kids uh, that it was a joke it is apple goop uh, we did a video if you haven't watched this video there is a link in the description below watch this video it was a brilliant video and uh, we do like apple goop uh, we did it a few times afterwards but not maybe as often so I, I showed my son and said no this is the video remember we did the apple goop and he said all oh, right all right yeah I remember so in the end of the book he have master recipe nutrition table of meals it's a brilliant to do that uh, he also have i think he had on the first uh, cookbook i'm sure he did no that was training Oh yeah, references. Yeah, he had on the first one too. That's brilliant to do, I think, uh, because you never see on any of the cookbook uh, nutrition references. I didn't. If you did, comment below. The first things what I noticed that it's relatively low in carbs and high in fiber, which is that's what majority people should have obviously with the ibs with the fiber you have to be a bit careful greg use a lot of prebiotic fiber food which is stimulate the gut bacteria to thrive the better your gut the better your mood your health your immunity your skin your weight a lot of people don't eat enough of fiber that's for sure i can tell that's for sure from the uh, new clients pictures I see a lot of people eat processed food especially in a lockdown overall what I can say about this and this cookbook so but we talking about the anabolic cookbook too he put a lot of work into it and I mean a lot I can see it it's all look very simple and all this soft and beautiful and all that uh, but I know how much work is in this cookbook one thing I noticed that if you want to make your book uh, simple it will require more work because you have to think the layout you have to type and check and it's just a it's all look very simple for you but for a person who make it's no wow cake we haven't tried that one i'm sure greg doesn't mind me to show but look isn't it good it looks delicious sorry greg i shouldn't probably show i don't know I don't know oops it's unclicked okay my page is now everywhere on the second cookbook greg worked harder than the last time it's definitely harder than the last time i wanted to release my cookbook first of january but with the lockdown and kids at home and the work it's hard i'm a perfectionist so the cookbook is ready but not 101 percent so when it will be 101% then I can release so I have to work a little bit harder uh, to make it 101% so it will look easy for you once I will release it of course I will let you know and hopefully I will do it this month at the moment it's a little bit hard but meanwhile you can purchase Greg cookbook and it's pretty straightforward I know Greg is not a tech person so he doesn't know maybe much about the computer and all these skills so um, 
maybe it would be a little bit easier for him to write this cookbook because he has some people to lay out, to print, to post, to, I don't know, doing all these uh, things. With me, I have to do everything myself. And maybe that's why I'm delaying <laughs> with the cookbook. Overall, I want to say it's fantastic cookbook. It's brilliant and I love it. My kids are going to use it, especially my son. And don't forget to post the trophies. That's his request. I want this muscles. The trophies. On this video, he keeps saying, Mommy, did, have you done the video? Have you done review on a video? And can Greg send me the trophy? Can, so don't forget, please. It's a request for his birthday. I hope you can do it. So it's the end of the video. I hope you like this video. If you have any questions, suggestions for future videos, please comment below and if you are new to my channel please like and subscribe thank you for watching look after yourself look after your health your health is your wealth and i will see you in two days ciao